Texas Tech basketball's a senior day on Saturday afternoon for the lone senior on this roster, Ty Nurse. His mother in from Vancouver, able to watch him live for the first time in seven years. Red Raiders playing host to Texas in the regular season finale from the USA. First half we start, great start for the Red Raiders. Jordan Tolbert underneath, bucket and the foul. Tech up to an 11-3 lead to start the ball game. Still in the first half, the senior Nurse stepping up the floater and it's a 17-10 lead. Next possession comes up with a steal, a 19-10 lead and Nurse again, this time from three. Ty Nurse with seven straight Red Raider points. It's a 22-12 a Texas Tech lead. Seven minutes left to play in the first half now. Jamal Williams the steal going the other way with it and up top to Jay Crockett. Red Raiders up 12 would lead it by as many as 17 in the first half and take a seven point lead into the break. Second half now, Tech in a scoring funk, six minutes without a field goal. Finally, Jay Crockett puts an end to that and still up three midway through the half now. Dayon Kravich inside to Jordan Tolbert, pushes the lead back to seven. 4.30 left to play now in regulation. Williams comes up with it and pandemonium at the USA. Tech up 60 to 42, Texas. Still hanging around though, 2.30 left to play, just a two point ball game now. Josh Gray in the lane, two of his 11 points on the day. That though, the last field goal of the second half and the struggles from the line, the story of the day. Tech just three for eight from the line in the last four minutes of regulation. Longhorns able to tie it up and force overtime to OT we go. Longhorns jump out to a quick three point lead. Minute left though, Nurse the steal, Gray gets it back to within one. They tie it up from the line. So tied up at 69 final seconds and Julian Lewis though able to get it to go and the Red Raiders lose it 71-69 the final in overtime. A tough loss on senior day against a rival. But whatever the case, absolutely a hard fought loss. I told them as, as a coach, I was very proud of their approach and the way they played. I thought they played uh, their tails off. Uh, we just came up short in the concentration area at the foul line, uh, missing 17 free throws. I mean, it was a difference in the game. It was tough, you know, just, I mean, for the rivalry with Texas and Texas Tech, and especially, like, we were out there fighting, you know. We had it, and we came up with energy, and we wanted to end tie on a good note, you know, and it just hurt a lot just having him have the end that way. I mean, we played good, but I mean, still, it was, a, it was like another moral victory that's it's not cool at all. I mean, it's tough, you know, uh, to win in this league, you gotta make sure you take care of free throws and turnovers and stuff like that, you know, but um, I'm still proud of our team and coach is still proud of our team. And we still play very hard and, um, you know, it was a tough loss, like you said, sometimes the ball doesn't bounce your way, so. You know, one of my biggest slogans you guys know is playing, being the best team you can be uh, by the end of the season. And if today was the end of the season, or this game marked the end of the season, I think those guys achieved from where they won, where they were in October to where they are now, I would say that they are, are, are pretty, uh, have pretty much improved uh, significantly. So now the Big 12 tournament in Kansas City Tech opening up with West Virginia on Wednesday at 6 o'clock from the Sprint Center. For Texas Tech TV, I'm Brandon Riley.